ergonomics in surgical environments. Nowadays, ergonomics are growing in importance. No one could deny the fact that this application may improve our daily life, not just in everyday tasks, but even in complex situations such as the theme related with this paper. Ergonomic in surgical environments becomes a key element when the patient's condition might be improved, obtaining satisfactory results since it has been applied. However, during an operation, many ergonomical issues are still open points for surgeons' teams. Accessibility, medical instruments and maintained postures have been studied in depth for many years and still now are a common topic of discussion. It is important to highlight that the concept of ergonomics is not just related with the user, but with the user and its interaction with the surroundings. According to that, several studies with different samples have revealed that the surgical teams consider improvements related with their ergonomics necessary to prevent discomfort, fatigue, physical strain, or even lesions in specific areas. Because of this, the staff is in high risk for work-related musculoskeletal disorders, which are really common among surgeons. It is certain to say that the laparoscopic surgery is the most affected due to the tools used and the forced postures that are required during an operation. Maintaining those postures have been revealed as one of the worst cases and are directly related with the surgeon's ailments. Besides, the fatigue and maintaining postures might affect to the body control and concentration, which may put in risk the patient's life. As a result of that, surgeons have developed pains related with their work. Usually, a surgeon stands in a upright position performing a surgery, being the chair work the second option. Both of them are related with the back pain mainly. Neck and head complaints are also reported, and hands and worst pains are especially suffered during laparoscopic surgery. But how could we improve the situation? Firstly, it is necessary to find a way to study positioning. It is known that several postural analysis methodologies are used in order to find critical points during a repetitive task. In this case, rapid upper limb assessment system seems to be the most suitable way to get an overview of those ailments and try to find a starting point to improve the situation. But what might be done? Well. The main researches aim to surgical equipment as one of the source of surgeons' ailments. It could be set for groups where improvement are needed. Firstly, surgical equipment, where especially the design of the handles are really complex and the grip is essential in most of the cases. Surgeons demand palmar supports to avoid discomfort in wrist and fingers. Operation tables. Its multipurpose design means that its regulations are not always as optimal as they should be. The main complaint among surgeons is the lack of a lower aid. In case of foot pedals, several ergonomic criteria are hard to accomplish, since most of the times are not at surgeon sites or hidden. However, it is common its use, and it's also common use the wrong pedal by mistake throughout an operation. Finally, other elements such as chairs, lights and screens, which have not been above much in the recent years, need to be improved. These devices should be also taken into consideration in the following studies in order to redesign it. To sum up, it can be said that ergonomics is a key factor for surgeons' performance. The main ailments related with surgery are focused in upper body due to the maintaining upright positioning throughout a surgery. Improvements in surgical environment it should be seen as a companion of surgeons and the interactions with the operation room. To conclude, prevention by working in correcting bad postural behaviors in surgeons and work in new tools by redesigning the correct ones should be the future lines of research. Thanks for watching and see you on Team 2020.